All right, so in this tutorial, I'm going to show you exactly how you can use PropStream to choose a specific area when you're looking to find seller leads. So I have a buyer for Cape Coral, Florida, and they're looking to buy specific areas. So you're going to want to log into PropStream, which might take long depending on your internet. And then we're going to go ahead and search Cape Coral. Now there's definitely a lot of opportunities at Cape Coral. This is all Cape Coral. And then some even up here. But let's see. Ultimately, you have this road right here, Southwest Pine Isle Road. It goes all the way up. Bam. Now my buyer is buying south of this road so pretty much all of this really over here and then he's also buying up here this over here which is burnt burnt store so this area here and then this area so he's not really buying over here Especially over here, not really. Now there's other buyers who are. I'm in I'm in the process of, you know, building relationships with them. Actually one of my buyers is buying over here. Right over here. So realistically we could just pull a list for all of Cape Coral. But and for this video we're going to use this tool right here, the pen tool. So um let's see, we'll start from here. We're gonna mark all of this in Cape Coral. Up, 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 this little area right here, burn store, we're going to keep this area too, and then we're going to want to zoom in, and I believe about here. see it like that realistically I don't even know if he's buying here but we'll keep that too for sure he's definitely buying down here and he's definitely buying all of this so so far we have 11,000 oh wow that's way more 11,000 uh, 114,529 so then we want to break down these filters a little bit let me zoom in we go into filters so again, we're looking for seller leads when it comes to vacant lots. We're gonna come vacant, property type, vacant. We're gonna choose vacant, residential, recreational. Um, lot size, maximum, let's just put 30,000 square feet. MLS, nope. Owner information, we're looking for sellers, so we're gonna put individual. Years of ownership, minimum, let's put 10. Um, number of properties owned. Sometimes I put this in just to make it smaller. So let's put like four. And I dropped it almost a thousand. Now you don't always wanna do that because if you run into a seller that has like 15 properties and they wanna sell all of the properties, then amazing, you know? But a lot of times people that own, you know, four or five properties, they're, you know, investors that are just letting go of their properties. Um, possibly, possibly not. Most of the time, no. They just have properties. And we do not, you know, we're trying to find motivated sellers. So, anyway, so, but we do want to shrink this list a little bit. So, let's, let's put like, you know, five. Um, and already right, got 2,752. Now, that's definitely a good list. We can pull that list find a bunch of uh, deals with that list. If you wanna make it even smaller, obviously we can add, um, let's see, absentee out of state. So that's 1500, that's a decent sized list. Um, from here, you just wanna go ahead and export this list. So you would click here, add to list, Cape Coral, um, this little Cape Coral output. J, that's my builder's name. Um, and we're in September 2023. Save it. 
So I put Cape Coral, my builder's name. So this list is really specifically for him. You know, if um, if I did all of Cape Coral, then I just put all of Cape Coral. If I had a builder that's buying specifically here and I selected that area, then I'll put his name. And I also put the date. So then we want to go to my properties. We see we have all these different lists. We have Cape Coral, J2023, bam. Click here, it'll select all of them. Then we want to export this list. From there, you can get a skip trace and then add it to your dialer, add it to your text message platform, or single hand, you know, Google Voice, whatever you want to do. That is exactly how you can find properties, seller leads in PropStream for specific areas using this draw tool. Go ahead and click the link in my bio to get yourself a free seven day trial to PropStream. Then you'll be able to use it to find seller leads the same way that I just did.